Hey everyone, Jason Weckerly here. Right now, I'm going to teach you guys how to make a musky leader for musky fishing. A lot of guys like to use crimps, which I don't care for because if you don't use the crimping tool and the crimps properly, you can actually cut your leader. But the type of leader I like to use is fluorocarbon. 100 pound test and 130 pound test but this is a old spool of fluorocarbon I've had for many years it's still working great it's triple fish musky leader fluorocarbon that's what it says on the packaging but I also like to use cedar fluorocarbon but 100 to 130 pound test. I like using these clips right here that actually have like a circular kind of a holder because a lot of times when you're throwing those 20, 30, 40, $100 baits, your clip can pop open and you don't want to lose a lure. So, I use a clip that has a holder, a circular holder. Got to make sure it's inside that little loop. And I use a heavy duty ball bearing swivel. Just basic. You want to make your musky leaders about 12 inches long. So when you're making these things, give yourself I'd say about 15 inches of line to work with. Little nail clipper. And what I like to use is a canoe man knot. This is a knot that I learned on thenetsbite.com years ago. It has never failed me. And I throw big bulldog lures i throw butt tails and top waters all sorts of different lures never lost a lure never lost a fish the canoe man knot what you want to do is take your line make one loop make two loops kind of like mickey mouse ears and you shove the back loop through the front loop like that put your swivel on there take the tag end put it through the back loop and you just tighten it down just like that plain and simple it's kind of a loop knot like you'll get a tiny little loop which I like because when you're using crankbaits or any type of lure, if you got a loop knot, it can make your crankbait shake a lot more and swim properly. I'll do that again. You take your fishing line, make one circle and two circles and put that back circle through the front circle. Here comes my cat meowing. Take your swivel, tag in through the back circle. And then take a nail cutter cut this down a little bit but not all the way because I'll show you why sorry my cat's over here getting into mischief yeah you're mischievous take a lighter and Burn the tag end down a little bit. 
so that it mushrooms. You got a little bit of a hard surface there. Just reassurance, but I've never had one of these knots slip. Nothing. I mean, the canoe man knot is just absolutely phenomenal. And it's a lot better than, crimp, than crimps, in my opinion. But 12 inches long. You got yourself a perfect musky leader and I will promise you this knot will not fail it's as good as crimps if somebody knows what they're doing with crimps but the problem is with crimping fluorocarbon if you do it wrong you cut the fluorocarbon this canoe man knot is just simple I mean, you can tie that in a couple seconds, be done. That's a 100 pound test to 130 pound test fluorocarbon. Perfect musky leader. If you guys like this video, learned something from it, subscribe to my page, hit the like button. Good luck musky fishing, take care.